Hello, hello, hello. It is 9.23. And we just got back from the Lighthouse Show. Back there, it's still lighting. Look what MSC Ocean Key looks like at night. This is beautiful. I got a whole good view from my balcony. And they say the starboard is the best side of the ship. But I'm not even on the starboard. <laughs> She's on the right. And she gets to see all this beauty. Now as we were on our way to the to the tour pavilion boot the, our actual mini yacht cruise boat cruise got canceled where we could have cruised the water and watched the light show but that's okay because they still had the light show because of the water, the wind. It was right in, the winds was blowing. Now, I was a little taken aback of the negativity. Like, now, you guys heard me like, dude, what I don't, what I do is not complaining from what I just heard. Like, I heard so much negativity when the wind was blowing and everyone was standing right there under the, let me see if I can show you guys where we were. You can actually see it from here. We were standing right there under the pink, yeah, pink, that's, that's our tour pavilion where we meet our tour guides for our tours. And so we were, they, there are tables, let me see right go for the deal right up in this area with the umbrellas so when it started raining when it started raining we was able to pull out the umbrellas and stand on the table and then they were so sweet they actually actually let us in the pavilion and so to, to shield us from the rain. Strong tower. <laughs> to shield us from the rain. So that was, that was that. I told you that the, the service here is, what's the word? Grand here. I was looking for another word, but that's good. The service here is grand. And so, I understood if they had to cancel. Okay. But then folks start calling other. This is where the, the annoyance of complaints came in at. You know, folks start calling other folks names. Talking about if anybody going that cruise, you crazy. Like, that was just that was just too negative. I, I, don't, I don't do all that. I don't do all that. It was just too negative. And it, it's just, I'm not good with negative people and negativity. I'm like really allergic to negative people. Some people may, well I have been accused of being negative in the, in the past for small complaints. But no. I know folk that can, can complain about uh, foolery. Yeah. Foolery. That's the word. Ooh. About petty things. I don't do petty. Like, I never did do petty. About small stuff. Petty stuff. So, if the people got to, if the folk got to cancel, let them cancel. But you ain't got to call other folk names. Whoever want to go, let them go. What business, what business is it of yours? that they still want to go because they was giving everyone options they let everyone know what the risks were if you still want to go 
and if you were uncomfortable, they gave you the option to cancel and they will give you a refund. So if someone else wanted to go, why is that your business? So that's the issue with folk. Folk and other folk business. Folk don't mind their own business. Why is it your business? Why are you a busybody and other folks matters? Like, okay, you're not going. All you need to be concerned about if you say. Like, yeah, you're supposed to have a burden for people, but if folk want to go out there, you know, after they've been warned, it ain't for you to condemn them and name call. That makes you just as bad. Really? If not even worse. So, but anyway, we still was able to, I got footage of the show. It was beautiful. It was wonderful. I really just felt like Satan was giving us a pushback on the show. Because once we had the show, it it literally represented domestic violence, butterflies. They had butterfly, neon butterflies. Oh, goodness. Up and down the tower. Floating up and down the tower. It was beautiful. It was beautiful. Well, you guys, I'm going to call it a night and get ready for tomorrow morning. They say the weather's supposed to be better tomorrow. So, because of the negative people, they just refunded everybody. Because they at least had to have a minimum of 20 people on the cruise. And so they just refunded everybody. And we can't, they couldn't rebook us for tomorrow because we won't be here. We're pulling out. God hold at 6 p.m. tomorrow. I don't want to go home. <laughs> but they say, you ain't got to go home, but you got to get off the MSA. Well, guys, good night. It's been lovely. It's been an interesting day. All worth it. Tomorrow I'm going to do the Wave Runner tour at 9.45. Then I have the Lighthouse Climb. So, Shaden. And they say we're supposed to have good weather tomorrow. That's what they say. So... I should be on the beach and that will complete my tours in the end of my cruise and we're heading back home to Miami. It's been amazing. Yes, it's been amazing. Hope you guys enjoy. I know I did. Can't wait to do it again. On to the next one. Well, where to? Alaska 2022. Yes. Seven days. Seven days. On the board. Who ready? Alaska. Well watching. Who's ready? She ready. She ready. Then we got Barcelona, Rome, 2022. Who ready? She ready. Maybe. Ensenada, Mexico. Puerto Mulatto, Catalina. Who ready? She ready. Y'all ready? Come on. Got the sideline. Come on, book. With BXG Travel. We give you experiences beyond experiences over here. The best thing for you guys to do when you book with me is book for in advance. Stop waiting to the last minute. Folk want to wait till six months, five months, four months, two months. First of all, they close out itineraries.
60 days prior to selling. Some of you, I don't know what's going to happen. Well, that's what they come in at. That's what they come in at. Hope for things that is not seen. You don't know what's going to happen. That's that hope. You hope. You'll be able to go after you didn't pay your coins. That's what faith is. That's what she do. That's how y'all end up seeing her. And then you wonder why. Well, why she get to go? That's why she get to go. She got that deep faith. She got the extended faith. Faith and beyond. I believe. She 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 she, she believe in stuff she'll see. That's that blind faith that I was talking about today. You gotta have blind faith. Not foolery faith. But blind faith in God. Not in things. Not in man. Not in your own self. Not blind faith in your own self. Blind faith in God. Believing that if you're obedient, He'll add all of your desires onto you. He'll give you all, the, all of your desires. But first, you gotta be obedient. That's that's the key. That's the key, right there. That's the key. On to the next one. Good night.